Alright, hello everyone. Eam Supreme here again, and today, as you can see, Devil May Cry 5. Continuing on here with our playthrough, so we're going to do Dante Must Die mode. I was going to do Nero Bloody Palace because I figured out that you can actually just use super costumes through the Bloody Palace. So I beat on my other account with Dante and Nero, so I wanted to show you guys the easiest way to do it by doing that. But you gotta beat Dante in Must Die mode to get the super costumes. So I'll show that later. Um, last video I did Don or, uh, Bloody Palace with V, so if you need extra tips, definitely just turn on the super costume. It should be the easiest thing you've ever done. Now, when I go back and re-beat re the whole game on the special edition, I will not use any cheese. I think I wanna challenge myself uh, I'll get a little better and I'll try I'll try my best to not use any cheese or anything. Anyways, let's get into this. So for Dante Must Die mode, I'm just going to do mission by mission. I'm not going to try and do more than one mission at a time. So let's just get into it. So I got a PS5 today, but... It's still in a box, I just wanted to play <laughs> Devil May Cry, so here we are. The first time I did Bloody Palace the Super Costume, costume Nero, I died on stage, stage 101. It was so depressing. It was unacceptable, okay? But it's pretty easy. I'll show you my method. I don't even really use anything other than Gerbera, of course. And with Dante, I did it first try. You can just like sin double trigger through the whole thing with the super costume. Okay, I'm just going to do eight Gerberas. You know my style by now. I have a <laughs> I say this every video. So I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna say it this time. You know what I was about to say. Oh, come on now. Oh, I forgot I have to use like seeds again. I was like, that felt a little weird. Because I don't have all <laughs> max act for eternity. Okay, not so bad. Okay, pretty bad. I take it back. Okay, so when he shakes, just grab him. Then you want to use showdown when you get back on the ground. Or not. Crap, I tried to showdown again. I got hit, went. Oh my gosh, this is disgraceful. Um, but okay, let's go. Wow. Hey, let's try this again. That was that was embarrassing. Okay, 
can't believe I just killed him with that. Okay, huge points, huge points. So, as you can see, we're fine. So it should be an easy S rank on this one. Feels so weird now <laughs> playing, uh, playing normal Nero. I'm so used to having full exceed now because of the super costume Bloody Palace. So if you have high enough points, you don't even have to do anything at the boss here. So I'm just going to stand here and die. Yeah, I'm so excited we're finally on Dante Must Die mode. I really just want to get to Hell and Hell though. That's the last thing I need to do on my main account. And I'm excited to learn how to do it. I still haven't played Mission 8 yet. I've just been sitting on it. I just have no motivation to learn it. For some reason. Alright, let's see. Okay, huge amounts of points. Yeah, you need 6,000 to get an S rank on Dante Mastai mode, so we obviously beat that with ease. And that's gonna, that's gonna be it for this video, so I'll catch you guys on the next one when we do Mission 1 as Nero. Okay, so thanks for watching everyone, and until next time.